Welcome. My name is David Mack. I'm the board chair for Jewfolk Inc., the parent organization of TC Jewfolk, JLink, Folk Media, JCreate, and Minnesota Mamas. Along with the rest of our planning team, staff, and board of directors, I want to welcome you into what I hope will be a very exciting day. Over the next day, you're going to have the opportunity to hear from some amazing panelists, speakers, and musicians from all around the world, and also to participate in activities like an open mic, a cocktail hour, and yoga, among much, much more. This diversity in events may seem like a lot for a fundraiser, but it is emblematic of everything that Jew Folk stands for, which is to provide 10,000 ways to be Jewish. Well, all donations are very much appreciated, and we even have a match for every dollar you give. What we care about even more is that this event brings you joy, meaning, and connection in our Jewish community. So however you choose to support us, whether through a financial contribution, a purchase of a meal, or simply by participating and showing up for our events, we very much appreciate you being here today. And we hope that we can continue to become an even stronger resource for you and for our Jewish community. Thank you for choosing to spend your time with us. We know how much is on all of our plates right now, but you are what makes Jew folks so special. Whether it is through reading our content, writing an article, or coming to events like these, we exist to serve you and our community by providing a place of connection and engagement and your support helps us to continue to thrive, whether in a pandemic or more regular times. So on behalf of me and our board, welcome, take a breath, and enjoy whatever time you can take off on this vacation. Hello and welcome. I'm Libby Parker, the Executive Director of Jewfolk, and I'm so excited for you to join us on this journey. We're so glad you're here. We have worked hard to bring you a wide variety of experiences to best showcase our mission of 10,000 ways to be Jewish and to connect you to community and to one another. There are several experiences over the course of the next 24 hours that are never before seen in the Twin Cities, including Nefesh Mountain, who will perform live their unique blend of Jewish bluegrass music, some Jewish yoga and meditation, a culinary tour of Israel from Delicious Israel, which you'd only usually encounter on a trip there in person, a chance to hear from a panel of internationally based Jews doing Jewish and humanitarian work around the globe, and much more. You'll also have the chance to hear from some local guests. Tonight, dessert by Chef Zoe Moskowitz, lyrical stylings and storytelling from legendary Minnesotan Peter Himmelman, and the Twin Cities' very first virtual Jewish open mic night, hosted by none other than CCO radio personality, Jordana Green. Tomorrow, check out our J-Link breakfast with Amy Zaroff and John Dermazian, two incredibly talented local business owners who will talk about adaptation in this time and the why behind their work always. You can learn from local philanthropy professional, Robin Shine, about values-based tzedakah, and we're very excited to share that we'll be featuring a special The Jews Are Tired podcast with Minnesota's own Governor Tim Walls. We'll also get a chance to hear from a panel of Jews of color in our community about leadership and sing along with Wendy's Wiggle, Jiggle, and Jam, followed by story time with our local PJ Library chapters. There is something for all ages and stages of life so feel free to tune in to what appeals to you. All of this and much more await you in the coming 24 hours. And with your financial support, we can continue providing these types of experiences in the future. Over the past few months, I have found myself saying repeatedly that Jew folk was made for this as the virtual glue that connects us, especially now. And we're so pleased to have your support in this endeavor. While each of the sessions is free to attend, a generous contribution towards you folks' work has outsized impact on our community. We are a tiny organization doing some pretty big things. 
In addition to every gift being matched, your contribution will allow us the opportunity to continue being the primary source of Jewish news in Minnesota, providing unique and interesting chances to learn and engage, and most importantly, keeping our community connected now and well into the future. I want to particularly thank our matching donors for this event, our foundation donors and individual donors throughout the year, our corporate sponsors, our Jew folk board leadership and volunteers, all 36 of our presenters and speakers, and of course, the Jew folk team that I'm honored to lead. You all make this community a better place, and I'm so proud and honored as a transplant to call it my adopted home. Thank you for being a part of this event, for being present, and have a great vacation.